I visit Indonesia regularly, but this is my first time in Semarang. I'd like to thank the President for his gracious hospitality and thank the people of Semarang and the government of the province for their warm welcome. President Jokowi and I are having our first leadership retreat together. Indonesia is our close partner and neighbour, and this retreat is a good opportunity for us to discuss how we can advance our relationship. Our bilateral relations are in good shape. There are close interactions at all levels. I told the President we are keen to strengthen our economic cooperation with Indonesia, and we would like Indonesia to succeed. Singapore is, despite our small size, Indonesia's biggest foreign investor, as you've heard from the President. Our companies are investing not just in BBK region, Batam, Bintan, Karimun region, but also in other parts of Indonesia, including in the Kendal Industrial Park, which we will be opening this afternoon. It's a significant project, large scale, and it will create up to 4,000 jobs in Samara in Kendal. So it's a win-win outcome for Singapore and for Indonesia. We also reviewed the progress of our cooperation in other areas, including particularly in tourism, and we agreed that increasing tourism traffic will benefit both our countries because both countries are joint destinations which fit together. Tourism, tourists can visit both countries on one trip. Uh, we've just signed an MOU on tourism. It will open up more cruise routes for the rapidly growing cruise industry. And we are also supporting Indonesia's capacity building in the hospitality and tourism sector. We talked about investments between our two countries. We look forward to investments further growing between Singapore and Indonesia. And in particular, investments perhaps in the energy sector where we can collaborate on energy solutions which contribute to Indonesia's 35,000 megawatt power plant. I suggested to the President and he agreed that we should form an Indonesia-Singapore Business Council to add value to our partnership. This will enable our businesses to network more deeply and understand opportunities on both sides. The Council will comprise business leaders from both countries and be co-chaired my suggestion would be between our Economic Development Board and Indonesia's BKPM. I also, we also discussed with the President other bilateral issues. Uh, we talked about our counter-terrorism cooperation and I thank the President for Indonesia's action arresting, detecting and arresting the terrorist group in Batam, Gige and the others who were planning to attack Singapore, shoot rockets at Marina Bay Sands. And I look forward to our making our cooperation on terrorism uh, closer and deeper in many areas. Uh, I also thank the President for his actions in uh, tackling the Hayes issue in Indonesia, which has made a difference this year, and offered Singapore's help to deal with this transboundary problem which affects all the countries in Southeast Asia. Next year is our 50th anniversary of diplomatic relations between Singapore and Indonesia. I invited the President to come to Singapore. It's my turn to host the retreat, but it's also a good opportunity on the 50th of our anniversary for us to celebrate in a proper manner, not just our economic cooperation, but also our cultural, our social, and our many other aspects of our ties, which have benefited our both two countries for many years. Thank you.